super extra north. Extra north! And this is four walls. These four walls are where I spend most of my time. It's not where I want to or hope to. I look at the IV they put in my arm and wish I wasn't sick. I wish I was a normal teenager. These four walls have seen me at my worst. They have seen all the evil come out, yet no good come in. They have watched me feel the worst I have ever felt before, but they don't judge. They stay silent. They keep all my secrets. It's within these four walls I wish I had my life back. I wish I could go on runs without feeling like I was going to die. I wish I could go on bike rides with my friends and think everything would be fine. I wish I was normal again. It's within these four walls I wish I wasn't here. These four walls do judge me. They judge me hard. They stare and laugh because I'm not like every other teenager. I have to spend most of my days here just so I know I'll be okay. They comfort me and try to tell me I'll be okay, but the tears run down my face because the vital monitor won't stop screaming at me. These four walls are where I point my past, where I'm contemplating my future. My future laughs at me. It cries and screams. It doesn't know how Halloween these four walls be friends because maybe one day, will be a cure. But this disease is like Emily Dickinson, known but not talked about. Maybe one day these four walls won't see me anymore. It won't listen to my stories about how wonderful my life was a kid of poetry I wrote to get through it. The IV won't know my touch anymore. It won't understand how much I appreciate it when I needed it the most. It won't overhear the school gossip I wish I knew nothing about. The smell of sterile equipment follows me around like children to their mother when they get sick. These four walls have heard it all. The good, the bad, the between. But they stay. They never walk out.